not realizing that from the hurt, from the pain, that I was going to come out on top. You are sad. You're talking to your friend right now and you're saying that you're hurting. What you told them was a keeper turned out to be someone you're no longer with. And you're sad. I can help you with that. My name is Tessa Marie and welcome to my YouTube channel where you will learn the answers to life, your happiness and success. Subscribe to my channel so you can be notified when videos of this nature are released. Yes. It's terrible. You're really sad because you told the whole world this was a keeper. And I'm talking to both men and women here, not only to the women. And it turned out it's not a keeper anymore. That happens sometimes. And there isn't anything you can do about what has happened. It is as it is. You guys are no longer together. I am speaking to you from experience. I remember that a long, long time ago. But I remember that. When I believe I was in the love of my lifetime, it was going to be, this is it. And then it wasn't it. I was quite young, but I knew there was better than that for me. And what I'm willing to share with you is that going back and looking at what crashed it, what made it to go wrong, what you didn't do or what they did or what you did, Anything like that from the past is not going to put it back together again. It's like Humpty Dumpty. You know, all the king's men or all the king horses could have put him back together again when he fell off the wall. Well, the love for you had for this person and they had for you is the Humpty Dumpty of your life. They, it fell off the wall. It crashed. Pick up yourself, not the pieces of that relationship. Pick up yourself. Get your act back together. Step into the moment. And of course, I'm saying that it's easy for me to say, but no, it's not easy. I relieve it now by telling you it was hard. It was challenging. It had broken. I was, but I knew one thing for sure. I am worthy of a love of a lifetime. If you're looking for someone to be a speaker at any of your events that you're planning, get in touch with me. My email address is right here and you can contact me and I would love to give you more about making life choices to you or any of the topic on living a fulfilled life. Have a great day. I made a decision that I would find that love or that love would find me. And you know what I did? I am talking from my choice, my experience. I made a decision not realizing that from the hurt, from the pain, that I was going to come out on top. I happened to be standing near an open window and something came over me and I got what you'd call my mojo back. I got myself back. I got my mind back. I got my worthiness back. I got myself back. What I thought was a keeper is not a keeper anymore. Well, guess what? I got me back. So what I did, I remembered it as if I'm experiencing it right now. And really, I am. I stood at that window. I looked out the window and I said, somewhere out there, there must be somebody that will love me for who I am, who will accept me, who will stand with me, someone that will let me share their life with them. And also, I can stand with them, love them, accept them for who they are with no reason to fix them. Love their imperfections like they love my imperfection, yes. And I must have said that with so much energy and so much, such a high vib vibration that it happened. Somebody saw me and decided I was the person for them. And when we met, it was amazing, it was fabulous. And that person became the love of my life until their life end. So what I'm saying to you is that I know it's difficult right now, but put on your big girl boots, your big boy boots, tie up your waist and believe that you're worthy to get the love of your life. Copy me, stand up, be bold, speak it out loud at an open window, at an open door in the park while you're driving your car in front of a mirror and believe that somewhere out there, 
is somebody that is especially for me, who will love me for who I am and who I will love for who they are. Not expecting them to bend, twist and become somebody else for me or me becoming somebody else for them. Yes, I did say, you will find that right person if you hold on and believe that you too can have the love of your life for all your life. Take it from me. I know what it is to be loved and cherished and to love and cherish another one. So don't give up hope. Stand up. Be brave and believe you are worthy of attracting exactly what you desire in your life. And this time, it is going to be a keeper for keeps. Have a wonderful and amazing day. If you like this video, just click over here. There are more videos on this nature for you. Have a great and wonderful day.